Thousands of people in Florida will be waking up to scenes like this after Hurricane Milton hit the state as a category three storm. This video comes from Palm Beach Gardens, about 80 miles north of Miami. The National Weather Service in Florida believes multiple tornadoes touched down in that area. Roofs are ripped off, cars are flipped over, trees are bent sideways from the strong winds. Now those winds knocked out power to millions of people. Right now, the U.S. power outage map shows more than three million customers are in the dark. That's an increase of one million people just in the past hour. Now, Milton is being called a once in a century storm, packing with it 120 mile an hour winds and surges upwards of 13 feet. Right now, the National Hurricane Center says huge portions of West Central Florida are under flash flood warnings due to how much rain is falling and authorities are going through. They're checking for people. The center also says at least 19 tornadoes were reported before Milton made landfall. One area hit was St. Lucie near Fort Pierce on Florida's east coast. The county sheriff confirmed there are multiple fatalities at a senior community following a tornado outbreak. It's unclear how many people have died or how many others have been hurt. And again, authorities do say they are checking every house. Our deputies are out here. The fire district is out here. We're going through the rubble. We're trying to provide any uh, recover anybody that we can. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis says 9,000 National Guardsmen have been mobilized to respond to the storm, along with 1,400 search and rescue force responders. There are also 50,000 linemen on hand to help restore power.